This was the school where we got dropped off and my brother would jump over the fence and come back. He didn't like school because he had people that would beat him up and stuff. And um, we lived in a trailer park, and in the center of the trailer park was a, a laundromat <coughs> and, and kind of like a rec area thing, but in the laundromat. And uh, these guys got my brother cornered in the laundromat and was beaten on him. Well, I, I'm younger by four years or so. I run out down two or three trailers to our house, and I go flying in there, and I go, Mom, Mom, these kids are beating up Billy at the laundromat. And she was, uh, she was cutting some uh, meat for dinner, and she had this big butcher knife. It was thick to, to the power, and it was a curve. But anyways, <laughs> she just ran out of the house, and we went down there, and she comes in, and she says, You leave him alone! Get away from him! You leave him alone! And she's got this big old knife. <laughs> and these guys go, <laughs> jumping over the laundry mat stuff, climbing over it to get away from her, and out the door and left. And school spread the don't mess with Bill Harlow because his mother's got a knife that's this long. <laughs> <laughs> and well, anyways, uh, my brother Bill, as they were jumping off and running, he, he, he said to her, he says, uh, why'd you bring the knife? And she goes, <gasps> she drops it like that. She, <laughs> she forgot she had it. She was just in the mode. Because that's not my mother. She would not bring a knife to, to a fist fight uh, at all. It was just that she was coming and doing it, and she had to go save her son, you know. And, and, and uh, she was waving her hand. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> Those kids never messed with him again.